Good morning, muchachos. Good we're morning. getting ready. Good morning. We're getting ready to take a laundry to school. Are you ready for today? Yeah. It's your big day. Yeah. Yeah. You gonna run super fast, you think? Yeah, faster of everybody. Oh my gosh. But remember what daddy said, pace yourself, right? So you don't get too tired. Mommy, what is fast that means you don't Oh, oh, so running fast means you don't get tired? No. Oh, okay. So you're going to be like Sonic the Hedgehog or something? No. Oh, okay. I'm excited to watch you run, baby. Thank you. How many laps do you think you're going to do? Tell me. No, how many do you think you're going to run? I think you're going to run like circles. I think you have to like follow like, I don't know, cones or something. So you're going to have to follow and run. It's probably circles. So how many, how many circles do you think you're going to do? 48,000. Oh my god, that's a lot. We can how many times I'm going to run. It's so dust. Yeah, well, I'm excited to watch you, baby. Okay. I know you're going to do great. I will. I know. I want the best of everybody. I know you will, baby. She is so excited for her fun run. I'm excited to watch her, so um, we'll see how well she does. I think they said, like, the average is 30 laps. 30 so, laps? I don't know, that seems like a lot. It's probably small. So, yeah, I was thinking too like that's probably small, but at the same time like it doesn't it doesn't matter how many she does. If she does one, perfect. You know what I mean? So if She does 40 80,000. If she does, so yeah, 40 80,000 then that's perfect too. So, um but yeah, I'm excited we get to watch. Yes, baby. Um, and it's like a rainy, it rained all day yesterday, so it's like gross out, and it rained oh, last night throughout the night. There's a what, baby? Look. Oh, yeah, the big bump we're gonna go through. You're gonna put your hands up. Hands up. Hands up. We're at a red light, and the person next to me is staring, so we're gonna keep this angle here. But that, no, be stop. <laughs> <laughs> but um, there's a big like where we have to go to go to our school. It seriously feels like oh it's not a roller coaster. That would be dramatic, but it's yeah. a big old dip. So if you go fast over it, dip baby dip, <laughs> dip baby. So anyways, yeah, it's a big one, and we always put our hands up because I don't know, it's fun. I, anyways, I, I don't even know what I was talking about now. Run thirty oh. laps average. Oh no no no. The the run is actually gonna go inside now. It's gonna be at inside the gymnasium because it rained all day yesterday. That's where you saw it? Oh okay. So I can't imagine the course being that big, but I don't I've never been inside the gymnasium, so I don't really know how big it is. Here we go. Are you ready? Yeah. Woo! Hey Daddy, you're trying to find out. That was not even a big bump. Okay, you weren't well, going fast look. enough, Daddy. We're Jeez. going through the next one. We're going through the next one. Are you ready? Yeah. Woo! That was not good? Jeez, she's a thrill seeker like her mama. But all right, you guys, we're gonna go ahead and drop her off at school and watch Alondra do the fun run. Good luck today, baby. Alondra's fun run is over and she did, oh, I think this is what I need. I'm getting distracted. She did so good. Honestly, I was so proud of her. She did not stop to walk at all. It was inside the gym, so it wasn't like a big circle of running. Um, and they didn't keep track. I thought they would like keep track of like exactly how many laps they did. Sorry guys, I'm looking for hoagie bread. And they didn't, but Iram was counting and he stopped counting at 28. Again, it was like, a smaller um like laps but oh here's some sub red but she did really good nonetheless and i got a lot of pictures and photos and stuff to like send to family and to everybody that um did like pledges so anyways um she did really good we're now in kroger doing some grocery shopping because well back to reality mama Madi is gone and we need to buy groceries for food to make for dinner so i don't know why i've been i'm gonna try this bread this looks kind of good the oral wheat one we'll see um i feel like i've been on such a struggle bus lately with like i don't know like thinking of meal plan ideas it's just been like really hard for me and i don't know like i've also like not even been in the mood to even do it even though like it's not like i cook gourmet meals you guys already know but like even the crock pot like i'm just like eh, i could care less so i'm gonna force myself this week to like really get in the zone meal plan and you know have my meal set up and like start cooking again because i just have not i don't know like i've been like in a 
cooking rut. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I've just been like very lazy about it. So anyways, we're gonna go ahead and get some groceries here and then I think we need to go to another grocery store and then shoot, we have to go to Costco too because we have to return our old battery. That way we can get our $15 back. And you know, I want my $15 back. Oh yeah, we definitely doing some damage today. Yam and I are having a little Starbucks breakfast date and we've never tried the egg bites, believe it or not. So Yam's gonna do the bacon gruyere and I'm doing the ham and cheddar with peppers. We're gonna each share one and then if Yam really likes it, he's gonna figure out how to make them so we can have them at home. Mm, I'm excited. Hi, Vivi. Hi. How is school today? Good. Good? I like this oh, I like your necklace you made. It's blue. I mean, it's red, blue, red, blue, red, I love blue, it. Red, blue. What is that in your hand? No, the other hand. Hot chocolate. Yeah. I want you to sip that. Oh, okay, drink a sip. Just be careful, okay? Because daddy's driving. Oh my goodness. <laughs> she loves the Starbucks hot chocolate. And guess what? Mommy and Daddy have another surprise for you. Oh, I wonder what is that? I wonder what is that? What? Go ahead, put that down. Uh -huh. There you go. <laughs> See what it is. It's a chocolate cake pop. Cake pop. Yummy, yummy. Is that the is that your favorite one, the chocolate one or the pink one? Chocolate. Okay. Good job. Oh, so Daddy was right cuz Mommy wasn't sure which one to get you and Daddy said get you the chocolate one. Yeah, you did so good today. I'm so proud of you. You're welcome. Go ahead, take a bite. And the teacher said you got more prizes today, so I can't wait to see the other prizes you got. I got another frisbee. Another frisbee? Wow. I can't wait to see it when we get home. All right, well, you enjoy that cake pop and your hot chocolate because your teeth are covered in chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> now that we have a laundry, we are actually going to head to 99 Ranch, which is an Asian grocery store. We need to get some Japanese mayo. So we're going to stop there, get that. And then we also need to go to, I don't know what it's called, like a county office or something. But by the way, if you're a homeowner, I don't know if this is every state does a homestead exemption, but if you live in Texas and maybe you just recently bought a house or maybe you've bought a house for a long time and you just haven't done this, you need to file your homestead exemption because this way your taxes cannot go like through the roof and all of that stuff. So anyways, that's like what everyone kept telling us is like make sure you do this paper, make sure you do this paper so you don't get screwed over because you mm. will. And something like with the property value, right? Like if the, I don't, I don't know exactly how it works so don't ask me. So yeah, definitely make sure you do it. I mean everyone told us to do it so that's why we did it and I just know that like if you don't like it can like really raise like you could be paying more money in the long run and then also too you have until April 30th, right? I think it's April 30th is the deadline to turn it in. So obviously we have some time to turn it in but we've had the paperwork done for a couple of weeks now and I just honestly want to get it turned in and get it over with that way we're not like rushing last minute to get it done or god forbid we lose the paper and then we have to like get another one so anyways we're gonna drop that off too that way that is off of our to-do list we are home finally i feel like we have been I'm like home. just gone yes you're home i feel yes. like we have been like running errands all morning and i am tired it's 12 45 i turned in my homestead exemption filled out everything correctly so that is a plus and that is done which is big because obviously we needed to get that done. Mm -hmm. But now we gotta put all the groceries away. And look at all the groceries we have. I mean, I don't know, this might not be a lot to some people, but we have not done a big grocery shopping trip. I feel like since we moved into the house. So since we have a lot of groceries, it is time for a grocery haul. A grocery haul. All right, you ready for the grocery haul? Yes. All right, ready? Yep. Um, sour cream? Sour cream, yep, a big old jug. Uh, another sour cream. Cottage cheese. Cottage cheese. Steak. It's actually Chuck Roast, and Kroger is having a really good sale where they were half off, so we ended up getting a three packages of this. Mac and cheese. That's right, and they ended up being on sale, so I got four, but I got different varieties. Orange juice. Yeah, how many did we get? One, two, Three, four, five. Yeah, Melandra's favorite juice. It's orange cinnamon juice. Okay, this is all the same. So we got soup, chicken broth, 
take a box? Yep, and we got four of them. So that's all the same thing in this bag. What is it? Cinnamon. What? Cinnamon. Cinnamon? Yeah. No, it's cilantro. Cilantro. What's this? What? I don't know. Cilantro. Green onion. Green onion. What's that? Lime. Good mm -hmm. job, lime. What's this? Another one? Wait, what is this? Now I'm confused. Oh, this is cilantro. So what is yeah. this? Parsley? Oh, so parsley and cilantro. There you go. What's this? Pepper. Yeah, yellow pepper. And what's that? Yeah. Good job. Oh, this big boy right here. I can hold it. You can hold it? Yeah. All right, try to hold it. Is this, is this carne? Yeah, carne. Specifically, pork butt. Good. We actually get to bake it ourselves. Oh, so yeah. why do you like it? Because we have to bake it ourselves. We got it from the bakery. Do you know what that is? Soy sauce? Soy sauce? No, it's beer. Beer? Yeah, I got a Guinness beer because I need this for one of my recipes. What is that? Dandy? Chicken. Chicken. Yep, chicken thighs. What is that? I got it. Tong. Tong. Cheese. Yep, provolone cheese. More cheese, cheddar cheese. Cheddar cheese. What is that? Noodles. Yeah, egg wide or egg noodles. What is that? Bread. Yeah, bread for our sandwiches. Pepper. Chips. Pepper. These are chips. Jalapeno chips. Yeah, what is this? Got this? Yep. More of the chuck roast. Chuck roast. What is it? I don't know. Diced tomatoes. That's right, it can be <laughs> You're so funny. Yeah, okay, hold on. What is that? I guess. Tomato sauce. Tomato sauce. And recycle the You can recycle it. Yeah, you can recycle it. That's right. You can recycle it. Yeah? What and what's this? Pencil? Sauce. Tomato paste. And recycling. Do more it. recycling. Do you know what this is? Chicken. New England clam chowder. Maybe if it has recycling. You want to see if it has recycling on there? Yes. Yeah, she's learning that this week at school, just FYI. And this is Rotel. Does that have recycling? Right there. Yeah, right there. And then, do you know what this is? Horseradish sauce, mommy's favorite. Let's see if it has recycling. You think it has recycling? Oh, right there. It does on the box. Good job. That was a hard one to find. What's this? Macaroni and cheese. Yes, we like the Andy's macaroni and cheese. Do you like this one? You like the white one, right? Yeah. Okay, I thought so. I wanted to make sure. What's this? Soup. French onion soup. Yep. Maybe it has recycling. You want to see if it has recycling? Oh my gosh, are you going to do this on everything? Good yeah. job. What's this? Again. Beef consomme. Beans. Yep, black beans. Nutella. Oh, yep, Nutella. You're, and I got you the big one. I got the big one because she loves this one. This is the Kroger brand. It's really good. Macaroni cheese. Yes, more macaroni and cheese. Yep, this one has bunny. Apple pie. Yeah, mama's apple. Ooh, let me take that. We don't want to mess up mama's apple pie. What else? Chuck did Luffy. Yep, there. Buy one, get one free at Kroger. So if your kids love these. Daddy. Yep, daddy got three salads. Daddy. Yep, more salad. What's this? Daddy. Lettuce. Lettuce. You probably won't know what this is. Ranch packet seasoning. I knew it was. Ranch. Oh, you knew it was? Oh, okay. What's that? Sauce. Tomato sauce. Tomato sauce. More tomato sauce. What are these? Onion. Good job. What is this? A red pepper. Good job. Do you know what this is? Sauce. A chicken sauce. Uh, a chicken sauce? That's a good guess. It's bouillon. Chicken bouillon. Because you saw the chicken. Out. Oh, and the best for last. What is this? Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. And the best one which is Mexican Coke. Holy cow, what a mess from this grocery haul. But I believe, yes, ignore my dishes though. I believe that is everything. The only other things down here is stuff that we got at 99 Ranch. I got some more rice. Um, we just got like a bunch of stuff to make pho and ramen and we got a bunch of like curry, stuff like that. So and then oyster sauce. So that's basically everything that we got at 99 Ranch, just Asian groceries. Now we get the fun part of putting everything away. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And then I need to get to editing because it's now 101 and I have not even started editing 
yesterday's vlog for today. So, ugh, and I am totally not feeling like it. So anyways, I'm gonna put this away and then get to editing. Alrighty, the vlog is live. By the way, and I'm sure most of you guys have figured it out by now, but we had no car trouble today. So that was a relief for sure. And it was so nice, like not having to like worry about it. So fingers crossed, like I said, no car trouble for a long, long time. But anyways, now that my vlog is finally live, Edom is currently working on dinner, which I'm so excited about. He's doing steaks with chimichurri and then potatoes and that bread that we had got. It's like the bread dough that you just put in the oven and bake it. Um, I don't know, it just looked really good. And so he's also baking that. So I am really excited. But he just like closed the door and was like, don't come out until I say so because the, whenever he, he doesn't fry the steaks, but whenever he uses, I don't know, oil or yeah, whenever he cooks it some kind of way. Hi, baby. You want to sit in here with me? Yeah. Okay. Um, I get a very like itchy throat. My eyes will burn and I will start to cough a lot. And it's just me. Alondra's not like that. Yudam's not like that. And his mom, because it happened a couple of times when his mom was here because they were like frying and cooking some stuff. She was saying that I probably have an oil allergy and What's she knows allergy? it's like whenever daddy cooks on that uh -huh. thing with a, a certain type of way, mommy, uh -huh. mommy starts to feel sick. Why? I don't know why. So that's why my mama Maddie was saying I probably have like an allergy. I don't know. I guess she knows a couple of people whenever you cook with oil or whatever that that happens. So anyways, um, so he's like, yeah, just, just stay in here. So, you know, you don't feel sick or anything like that. So. I'm gonna do what he do says. You? I'm gonna stay in here. Do you? Yeah, I feel, it's not like sick, but do I don't know how to explain it. I get like an itchy throat and my eyes bother me. I know your eyes burn. Yeah, my eyes burn, that's right. It's kind of like itchy eye. Yeah. But it's like burning your eye. Yeah, something like that. It's kind of like fire, I mean, but it's not fire. It has burning your eye. Yeah. And itchy. This says, that's how you say itchy. So, like, if your eyes are itchy, my eyes are already itchy. And her eyes burn. Yeah. So, it's kind of like that, but that say to, wait, 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 wait. Itchy, itchy, and burning eye starts with, uh, um, if it itches, it burns. Yeah, that's right. Itches, it burns. Thank you for so, explaining yeah. that. She's seriously so cute. But anyway, since Edom told me to stay in here, I'm gonna do what the doctor ordered and I'm just gonna stay in here and I'm gonna binge me some Bachelor. Alondra's already digging into her steak, but whoo, woo, we got some surf and turf going on. My goodness. These potato, potatoes, I can't speak, are so delicious. Oh, look at that. Look at that like artistry right there. Oh ho 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 ho! Got some shrimp steak, chimichurri. Got some salads. Wow! Oh oh, careful! Oh my gosh! <laughs> and then we got the bread. Dang, I'm excited. And then I am gonna have me some moscato. This is my favorite moscato. It's Stella Rosa. It is seriously so good. How's the bread? Good. It's so good. Okay, awesome. Thank you, Poppy. Dang. No. Woof. Oh, thank you. I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here because honestly, nothing else is gonna Hi. happen tonight. Hi. What are we gonna we do? Watch a Lily. Yeah, we're gonna have some family cuddles. We're going to watch both and watch the video has the talk the frozen to talk to. The frozen to what? Cartoon? Mm -hmm. The DVD? Yeah, we don't have that yet. So we're gonna go ahead and just watch Frozen and thankfully Frozen is on Disney Plus because our Frozen DVD is scratched and so it skips and then it just will stop playing. So anyways, but we're gonna spend some family time and watch a movie. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys did enjoy today's vlog. Please give it a thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Two thumbs up, that's right. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye, Machacho. Bye, Machacho. Good night, everybody. Good night.